Hi, Aggies. This is Chancellor May and Lachelle, and this is our special Valentine's Day edition of Thursday Thoughts. And we're joined by three student interns here at Strategic Communications. They are going to ask us our questions. I'm going to let them introduce themselves as they ask the questions. Here we go. Hi, okay. everyone. I'm Juliet Hill. I am a fourth year communication major. Hi, I'm Megna. I'm a fourth year cognitive science and managerial economics major. Hi, I'm Farah. I'm a fourth year and I'm a political science and English major. Okay. All right, here we go. First uh -oh. question. Okay, so what is your love language? Oh. Mm. I, I, I'm really silly. I don't even know what that means. What is your love? So, <laughs> what is love language? Mean? Laughter oh. is, is probably our love language. Oh, right? is it? I don't know. It sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> the last time we didn't sounds, know what a cameo was. It sounds PG was. and it sounds like, you know, yes. believable. <laughs> yes, our love language is laughter. Laughter. Does that language? sound correct? I think that sounds good to That me. works. Okay, okay. Yeah, it yeah. does. Yeah. Okay. Well, what would you do without me? Yeah. What would I do? <laughs> All right, next question. Okay, my question is, do you have nicknames for each other? Uh, uh, we don't. We really don't. Really? No. I mean, we have the occasional deer, honey. Yeah. You know. But I don't think so. I think because we're engineers, it's like, your name's Gary. I'm calling you Gary. <laughs> You've called me much worse than Gary in our 28 Actually, years of marriage. Actually, my nickname for him is Chancellor. Chancellor May. Yeah, she does call me Chancellor May around I'm the house. related to you. All the time. <laughs> So it's, like, it's actually a little Chancellor annoying. Chancellor May, how come <laughs> this is happening? I wake up in the morning. Hey, Chancellor May. <laughs> okay, next. My question is, were you nervous when you got married? Oh, yeah. No, no, not ner I wasn't nervous. Were oh, you? I thought you would have been nervous. I was happy. Um, I, I mean, I was more nervous that something would go wrong. Right, right, because you're than, putting on an event yeah. and uh, you, you're scared you're going to fall or something. Someone passes out. Maybe and, uh, when I propose, I can. Can I tell the proposal story? Have I told that one in a long time? That wasn't the question. But I know. Sure. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm uh, editorializing. <laughs> uh, when I proposed to Lachelle, um, so I had I had it all set up right. I I went to a revolving restaurant on the top floor, and I had the ring, and I had this line about you know a ring has no beginning and no end. And we're in this circle that has no beginning and no end. And I want our relationship that I had. A, I was ready. I mean, I was Mac Daddy player. So, <laughs> so I got to the, maybe the first line and I opened up the box and the, she saw the ring. She jumped up and screamed and ran to call her mother. No cell phones in those days. So I'm sitting there going around the circle in the restaurant <laughs> with an empty box. <laughs> <laughs> and she never answered. She never answered the question, will you marry me? So I still don't know. Yes. <laughs> but no, I don't think we were nervous, but just the whole day that you put on. One day when you get married, you'll it, see it, that. It's more fun than it is nerve wracking. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's the only day where everybody from all aspects of your life are there, your friends, your right. family, your coworkers. A few questionable family members, you know. Those people. <laughs> <laughs> but they're, they're all there to celebrate you. And usually yeah. there's not all these different groups that are in the same place at the same right. time. Right. I guess the only other time it happens is at your funeral and you can't enjoy yeah. that. So, yeah. Right. right. So. <laughs> yeah. On a higher note. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. That was kind of negative. Uh, the last one is what makes you most proud of each other? Oh, okay. That's a really first? good one. Yeah. I, I have one. Oh, you, you do. Um, I have a lot of most proud for you, I think. Um, and, uh, it's probably mostly what you're giving spirit. So oh, I love that nice. you always want to help others, help the students, um, not just on the job, but in general. Yeah. Like, you know, we're just, that part is, I think, that I'm most proud of you. Outside of, you know, academics and the fact that you're chancellor and all those other things. But I think yeah. I'm most proud of your giving spirit. So there are a lot of things I love about you, but the one I'll highlight is um, your, you can't take away Lachelle's joy. <laughs> She's always That's true. fun all the time. <laughs> yeah. You see her dancing in strange places. <laughs> um, oh, uh, it's funny. When I dance in strange places, you're like, do you, must you really do that right now? <laughs> sometimes that embarrasses me. <laughs> right. But I also love it too because, yeah. you know, she's, she's almost never down or sad. She's always bubbly and vivacious and she's great with people and when we go to parties and events together she uh, gets along well with everybody and that's really important as a partner for in this job uh, to have someone like like you who's got that kind of oh, personality thank you. yeah
it's just enjoying life. You just have to realize that. Right. Everybody out there. <laughs> So. Um, that was our last question. This was uh, fun. Thank you for fun. asking. Yeah. We'll have to do this format again sometime. <laughs> Make sure you're available next time we need you. <laughs> so uh, they didn't know they were they were getting into this today. I like to be spontaneous. Uh, so until next time, Aggies. Uh, that's Thursday thoughts for this week. So stay healthy and stay safe. Go, Go Ags. On.